Hello and welcome back to Planet Coaster, or let's continue with things. So, last time we built the whatever I named it, the Raging Rapids of the Nile, even though that doesn't make any goddamn sense. And, uh, you know, uh, we just opened it up, so I'm excited to see if people end up coming over here. Uh, anyway, our park seems to be hum drumming, dumbing along. Um, and we got a new challenge of build a coaster with the biggest drop of at least 55 meters. I feel like we've done that, haven't we? Like... Isn't that the easiest challenge in the fucking world? Where Where is, uh, testing results, biggest drop? Oh, you've got to be absolutely fucking with me. <laughs> okay, we need to build a roller coaster that's five meters taller than this. Fucking bullshit. We could even drop this five meters down lower. Man, it's just horse hockey. Seriously, is this 55 meters or is this also 50 meters? Oh, it's only 39 meters. That's some pussy shit. Anyway, um... Let's go ahead and unpause it and see if we're making any progress or if anybody even wants to come down here. Uh, I suppose we should throw in some uh, things like benches, um, some trash buckets, if I can call you my trash bucket. Sorry, what? Uh, all right, trash bucket, trash bucket, trash bucket. There we go. I think people will be happy with this. Hopefully they don't need a bathroom all the way down here because I feel like we have plenty. Do we have plenty though? Where's our nearest bathroom? Like, over here? That's fucked up, isn't it? Okay, I think it might be time that we build another bathroom. Like, that's just sort of sadistic that we make him walk that far to go to the bathroom. So you know what? I have a fucking fairy tale bathroom. Right here on the corner. Okay, thank God. I don't want anybody pissing their pants. That would, that would probably not cause a lot of happiness. Uh, we might as well go ahead and add... Something. Some kind of scenery. Uh, you have some clay pots, and that's too big. And that's everything's just about too big. Have a bush collection. Congrats. You're now bush like. Whoa. But is he more George uh, H.W. Bush or uh, George W. Bush? Who knows? Okay, is that 100%? Because we had a little fair. I think everybody's looking happy, right? Uh, 22? Only 22? What is wrong with you? You don't understand the value of small bushes, do you? Or clay pots, honestly. Uh, there's gotta be something long and thin. Oh, <laughs> I'm mostly just to fit in like this corner here. Um, you know what, I'm, uh, you yeah, know, that's not gonna fit. As more and more loaded in, it, it's becoming clear that that is not working out. Um, sword in the stone, okay, that thing's huge. Fit it in there. There we go. Are we at 100 yet? 39? Oh my god, that's not even making a fucking dent in this shit. There we go. Have have that. We're done. I'm no more. There we go. 66. <laughs> Apparently that statue is baller as hell. It seems to be like directly correlated with money, which is just typical, isn't it? Uh, money, money, money. Get that moolah. That bread. Chase the bread. Okay, I'm hoping this ride is popular. As you know, it is. It's relatively exciting. Not too nauseating, not too fearful. Should be a nice, quiet humdrum along the Nile. Uh, as long as there's no crocs. Because crocodiles are fucking terrifying. Like, for real. Um, anyway, we should go check if we have any research done. Oh, so close. I would like to have the money to build another coaster, just so we can, like, coaster shit. You feel me? Like, get the 55 meter drop. Eh, we don't seem to be making a whole lot of money. Did something huge break down? Did a roller coaster break down? Is this this thing is open? Nobody wants to ride on the bumps and humps? Get on the bumps and humps, guys. Maybe it just opened or something. This is worrisome. It made three grand last month, which these all made like three grand last month. <laughs> last month. I love it last month. This one not as much. Maybe the ticket prices are uh, yeah, it's not quite as high. Why don't we go ahead and raise the Matterhorn to fourteen dollars? Um. It does seem like we have a lot of broken down rides, so I might end up having to hire another mechanic. And why don't we just go ahead and do that? Just, that's a janitor. That is the wrong person. They don't even have the same skill sets. Get in here, Alonzo. Alfonso. Um, Missy Elliot here. We could, that's a, just a fox with a coffee cup. You know what? Just get the, the cow that bumps on their udders. I don't know. It seems like people like the other one, so why not have a bumping cow? You know, you gotta promote the brand of the uh, Cosmic Milkshakes, because those things are making money 
in our park. No lie. Profit. Um, we are making no money from rides and tickets this month for some reason, and I don't know why. Is there some ride that's just not making any money? Stupid. Um, because it's the fucking uh, carousel and nobody cares about it. The R Nile hasn't made any money yet, but that's because it just opened. Everything else is making money. Don't know. Don't know why that's the case, then. Maybe it's... You know, I feel like we're making money anyway. <laughs> but who knows? Anybody on these things? I mean, like, you guys can, like, take off whenever you want. Don't let me hold you back. Or is it... I think this might need to be staced out less. I feel like... This guy's gonna make it before all these others leave. How can we change that? I know there's a way. Minimum waiting time. Not 60 seconds. Make it, like... 30 seconds. And maximum... Maximum can do go down to, like... I don't know, 80 seconds? Sure. There we go. I just want to see these people off, but, like, they're not going anywhere. These people are relatively... Oh, now they're going? Maybe just because it wasn't full? Oh, no, there's still people queuing. I don't know. That was weird. I would love to see more people come out here and queue, but they're just not making it. Nobody loves me. Um, yeah, okay. I mean, it made zero dollars so far, but... <laughs> Hooray. Um, okay, we have 3,000 people in our park now. Congratulations, us. Park balance bonus of 55. That's almost to the 60 that we require. What are people saying as an overview? Not queuing that long to go on the inverted twisty nips. Chief beef is too long. Everything else is, like, lovely. It's just a matter of queues, and we're slowly alleviating these queues, it seems like. Besides the poor inverted twisty nips, that, that ride, I understand, is very popular. It just makes sense. I can't believe the sky chair ride is so popular. It doesn't... I mean, there's still people queuing for it, too. We might as well up the price by, like, 50 cents. It's not making that much of a profit, right? Just add more money to it. Okay, people are going on the bumps and humps. That's good. Bumps and humps gotta make the ride. Gotta get the people. It is so long, though. Ugh. I'm not proud of this coaster. I'm very proud of the inverted twisty nips. The more coasters and stuff I build in this park, the more I'm proud of the inverted twisty nips. It's just such a good coaster. Well made, everybody loves it, it's perfect. And fuck stupid. Stupid can go fuck itself. I might as well just delete this thing. I don't know why I built it, just because it fit. God, I hate the stupid fucking carousel, you stupid fucking bitch. God, shit. Okay. Um. Yeah, I would love to build another coaster. If we are going to, presumably when the research finishes, where would we put it? I'm thinking we put it out here to attract more people along this drag, which will eventually extend out this way. Because uh, we've got some on all these other drags right now. I would love to just keep expanding them. I don't want to have, like, a coaster alley. I don't think that works out for the best. you got to separate them a little bit. Because they do, I think they do drive demand in other parts of the park. This is done in, like, half a second. Uh... Uh, hey, there we go. Okay, what do we get? The monster. It's a wooden coaster. So what can this coaster do for us and for America? Oh, there's a pre-built one. First of all, I would love to see it. There it is. It's short, but it seems relatively exciting for it. But once again, I'm, like, not a bitch who bitches out and doesn't build a custom coaster. So, like, who cares? Um, all right, what was it called? A wooden? Just, oh, the monster. There it is. Um, cannot invert for all ages chain lift so it seems like a good coaster to build for the next time you know we do have a lot of other um, family friendly coasters and that can invert like uh, this choo choo train one and all that other shit not a lot of people are coming over here kinda sad I really feel like this would be a popular attraction I mean like there's still people on it but I'm realizing a quick problem here is that we have too many cars we actually have too many cars. So I'm going to have to just go ahead and close this ride temporarily. We have, like, three too many cars. Because, like, they just were stuck in the queue. We can't not have them stuck in the queue. Because then people are just sitting here at the exit while they can't leave. We don't want that. I just want a constant flow. Let's go ahead and open it back up. Why Do I seriously have to test it again? You've got to be fucking with me. <sighs> We didn't even change a goddamn thing. All right, see you in like 30 minutes. Da, 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 da. I don't care anymore. Um, 
how much is this coaster gonna cost me? That's what I'm thinking. Wow, I I just realized that our like park management directly is offset by our shops and facilities, and then our rides and tickets is like all of our profit, which isn't a bad thing. Where are we spending all our money in park management though? Staff wages, like 100% staff wages. Research cost doesn't help, marketing cost doesn't help, but like staff wages, holy shit, we spend so much money on these people. And they're honestly not as happy as I want them to be. Oh, uh, are there any shops that aren't making money? Um, are these... I, these aren't shops, these are shops. Is there any shops not making money? They're all making money, surprisingly, except Looney Bloons 10, which is closed. Perhaps we should open the Looney Bloons again. I mean, I know they didn't sell previously, but like... Why not? Select building? Looney Bloons 10. No. Can I just like move it and have it reopen? No, that didn't do shit. I just want to hire a new vendor. Not sure how to do that though. So I guess it's like permanently closed. Why don't we just go ahead and delete it? It's not making us any money. We have to select the building again, don't we? Alright, delete. See a Looney Bloons. I guess people just don't like, uh, you know, little mementos anymore in this one. I feel like they should. Is it done testing yet? Okay, now for some reason, like, they're all clustered together, and I'm pretty upset about that. Like, they're right next to each other. Because I guess they just filled up with people. So you know what? Just stop. Just stop. Just fucking kill me. I don't know. I don't know. I should have just let it finish. No, no, why don't we, why don't we just fill it back up with cards? Fuck them if they're waiting, right? You know what? Just, just go. Just go. Be free. Let's go ahead and start building our coaster. Our wooden, wooden coaster. The monster. Probably do have to pause it if I don't want it to have to lag like a bitch, though. So let's go ahead and do that. Um, okay. So where do we want to have this coming out? I'm coming now. Um, I'm thinking maybe this direction? Because, you know, we kind of got some room over here. Uh, we can always figure the path out later. I think the coaster is more important on its own. Uh, first things first, can we add any more stations to add more cars? You know, just get that to the max. To the max. That's the max. Back to cart. Chain lift. Up, 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 up. Up, 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 up. Uh, so we definitely need to get this one... 55 miles an hour, or 55 meter drop, excuse me. I believe the other one was average of 30 miles per hour still. Yeah, that one's still tough. Also, this thing is already, like, really high. I think this is going to be 55 meters. <laughs> I, think, I think we can taper this off now. Um, all right. All we got is the... Oh, we got some different stuff this time, actually. We got the figure eight. That's got to be fucking terrifying in a coaster. In a wooden coaster, excuse me. Like, seriously. Wooden coasters, I think, are known for being a little more fearful. Not that I'm a roller coaster expert, but, like, shit, man, they're rickety and shit. That'd be pretty fucking spooky to do a loop-de-loop -loop figure eight. Um, might as well, like, come down and do one of those then, right? How far did this park go? All the way out here, down the hill? Into the fucking ravine? Holy shit, what if we put our coaster through the ravine? Think about it. <laughs> think of the value. I don't know what the value is there, I'm sorry. Um, okay. 55 meter drop, so we really can't do anything besides just drop it down, which we might as well do. Probably don't want to make it the steepest thing known to mankind. At some point, I think the excitement runs out and the fear sets in. Just like everybody shit in their pants all of a the sudden. There is so many struts here. Are these all individually rendered too? Because that can't help the frame rate. Holy shit, this game's frame rate could use some work. Optimization is an important thing. All right, that's got to be like 55 meters, right? We at least got to start tapering it off here, just so that they don't lose their fucking mind. Okay, okay, okay. They're gonna keep going. And then I think we're putting them through the ravine. They're they're going down. Um, not up left, down down right, just like that. But we got to extend this bad boy. Then even like do that or something? I don't know. I feel like they're gonna die. I feel like they're still gonna have a shit ton of speed coming out of here. So we are gonna have to do this by custom. This one's definitely gotta be custom. Okay, so go down slightly. Hope this thing can invert at least. Oh wow, they can go up to 85 degrees. That's that's a lot stronger of a turn than most of our rides or most of the other coasters. 
23 degrees, not so sharp turn. Put us uh, 45, 68. Um, probably gotta start like tapering this off or something. Maybe even go up a little bit more. Back down, 23, zero. <laughs> okay, now we're in the loop to loop, or we're we're in the ravine. Now can we do something crazy? Can we do a figure eight? It's a little big. It's a little big, at least on that side. Also, we don't have the money because this thing is huge. Um, there, shrink it. Shrink. It won't shrink either way. That's unfortunate. We might have to do an up first. If we hook it back up out of the ravine, through the ravine, of course, um, if only we could make like a tunnel with terraforming or something, that'd be pretty sweet. Uh, do we have to do this manually again? I don't know if we're going to have enough money to finish this coaster. This thing turned out to be really expensive. Alright, what if we gradually go back up? No, I want to go up. There we go. That's perfect. Something like that. Uh, okay. And then maybe we start uh, turning it back down into the ravine again. What if, because, you know, that'd be exciting. This is going to be pretty crazy if we go straight back over our old coaster piece. Okay, back to zero. Is that enough of a turn? I think we're running straight into it. I don't think we turned enough. Never ever. Okay, keep going. Okay, that's good. That's Gucci. That's Gucci right there. Straighten it off. And then we are down to like 300 bucks. <laughs> uh, okay. Okay, we just want to get him enough speed because I want to put him through the crazy eight. Gotta put him through the crazy eight some point. And we're out of money. Alright, so so far this is pretty nuts. Um, I figure we might as well go ahead and, and test this. Unpause it while we're at it. And just see what the hell is going to happen when we put people through this. Might as well just get to the top on 3 speed. What do I mind? Here we go. This is going to get absolutely insane speed, I'm thinking. At least here. And I do not want to put people through this turn at 600 miles an hour. Holy shit. This is so unbearably fast for people, I'm guessing. This is either going to be the most exciting coaster of all time, or the most terrifying. Uh, there's no middle ground on this sort of thing, so I'm excited to see once we can f have the money to finish it. Like, holy shit, it was surprisingly smooth for going that fast, and it'd be really good if we could, like, maintain that sort of, sort of excitement. Because holy shit, that was actually crazy. Uh, I'm, so anyway, once we get enough money back into our reserves, we can go ahead and dump this into a crazy eight right here. What the hell is that? Oh, that's part of the coaster. Um, dump this into a crazy eight, come back out, and then just sort of up and down it back to the start. Because I think we definitely have enough speed off of that drop. That drop is crazy high. Uh, all right, let's go ahead and, and uh, speed this up a little bit just to get us some money. We could always take out some more loans, and honestly, like, we might as well. I just don't want to have spend the time. Um, I know the Monster 2 has not been tested. That's because it's not complete, you little fucking slut. Uh, okay, 3,000, 2,000, 1,000. Let's go. Let's -a go back into the coaster building. We have eight more grand to spend, although I still think the, uh, the Crazy 8 is really expensive. Uh, okay, so flatten it out, maybe like one more, and then here we go. We got a crazy eight. It no other way. Oh damn, that's perfect, son. I would love to keep it at an angle here. Is that straight? That's a slight turn. I don't know if that's better or worse than just keeping it straight. I think it might be better to keep it straight. I would also like. I can't make it any smaller. It's a little worrisome because that's pretty tall. Uh, well, we might as well just go ahead and place it in and see what happens. Well, that's unfortunate. <laughs> um, okay. Guess we go one more and see if we can do it. Okay, we can do it. Praise the B-movie. There we go. Get us out of here. <laughs> Straight to the moon right afterwards. Um, okay, so assuming you can make it through here with enough speed to go up again, uh, we just gotta start turning it back towards the start. 45 degree. You know what? Even 68 degree. Make it a crazy turn. Um, 
Okay, then, then start it. Whoops, no, go back one. Go back one. We, we want to start to go straight here. If I could just get it to work. Oh, shit, I misclicked so hard. Oh, no. Oh, come on. Come on, there it is. All right, back to 45. Back to a little more straight. Make sure to click on the piece. There we go. We can even start to flatten it off a little bit. Put it back to zero. That's going to be a little bit of a crazy bend. All right, here we go. Assuming we have enough speed to get out of here. And then it's just a matter of going back down and back up to maintain the excitement. As, uh, as I've seen with other coasters. Is that, you know, towards the end you just don't get a lot of excitement anymore. You just kind of got to go up and down. Keep people in the thrill ride in the moment. You know, they might not be going as fast as you want them to, but at least they'll be going a speed. <laughs> assuming assuming we can get through that uh, without crashing and burning. Um, I would I would love to auto-complete it, but in my uh, other experiences, it just doesn't ever work to auto-complete. Like, it's just too sharp of a last turn. Um, can we just, like, go really, really steady? Really steady down. Down, down. Is that going to work out perfectly? Because that'd be great if it did. Is it? Oh, it actually did work out just perfectly. And we still have enough money to make any changes we want. Alright. Well, let's go ahead and see what the hell happens. Okay, here we go. Unpause it, of course. Three speed it up to the top. I think that's three speed. Alright, there we go. Up, up, and away. I'm so excited for this one. If this works out to not be the most terrifying ride of our lives, then, uh, okay. This is going to be the most successful coaster, if it doesn't kill anybody. <laughs> I'm worried, though. I'm worried that these turns are a bit too sharp for the speed we get right off the bat. Here we go. Oh, shit. Sharp turn incoming. Oh, a little, little ragged. Oh, boy. Could probably smooth the banking on a lot of these turns. Okay, do we have enough speed to get through this? I'm, I'm thinking yes so far. Oh, wow. Oh, just enough to get over the edge. But now do we have enough to finish the ride? Up and around. All right, down and up. And down and up and down. And come on, one last up. And he's made it. Oh, my God. It's just enough speed. We could probably use some brakes on that last turn, I'm thinking. But my god, I hope that is a great coaster. I need, I need, oh, nope, 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 it's terrifying. <laughs> Damn it. I was really hopeful. Because that seemed like a really fun coaster in my mind when we were riding it. Turns out it's just scary. It's honestly just fucking terrifying. It had a 75 meter drop. Average speed of 29! No! It's so close. Okay, we have to make a few changes. It's too terrifying for anybody to get on this thing. So, let's go ahead and pause it. What happened? Where's all the excitement lost? Because you'd think, like, this is all exciting. It actually is, like, mostly exciting. This last little bit, not great. Not great, but still, like, above 5. I can't believe it only averages three. Maybe because it's just such a high drop that uh, that it's just not as exciting to anybody. It takes such a long time to climb. Uh, but everything else is, like, really good on excitement. Honestly. Even this, even this, it's all good. The figure eight, but what ha where's all the fear coming from? Everywhere. Literally everywhere. <laughs> At no point does it have time to bleed off. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> it's like, as soon as you hit the top, oh yeah, that, that's a little not so scary. And then fear, 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 fear. Oh shit, we just took a sharp turn. Like, we're about to fall off the edge. And now you're in for a wild ride of like 30 more sharp turns. And we never even give them a break. It's down to fucking okay meters at the end. Uh, what about nausea? I assume it's it sort of has a correlation with fear. On all these sharp turns, yep, yep, definitely these sharp turns right here. It's 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 slowly draining off on this crazy eight, um, but it just comes back, comes back pretty quickly, and then it it drains off by um, by the end. But that's just not acceptable. Ah, uh, damn, man. 
it really seemed like a fun coaster. <sighs> Shit, how can we make this more exciting? And less terrifying. I, f I still feel like it's an exciting coaster. It just takes too long to get up. But we barely have enough speed to get to the end. It's a dilemma. It really is a dilemma. Because I want to keep it exciting all the way through and have just enough speed. Because putting in another lift is a death sentence for a coaster. Honestly. If you have another lift, then you're done. Because it takes too long to finish. Nobody's excited by a chain lift. It bleeds off everything. Everybody hates it if you have another chain lift. Okay, so, well, I guess first things first is we go into editing. Where do we want to edit first? Do we want to change the drop? Um, it is bigger than we need it to be. No lie. So I think we can delete at least the top few sections here. Make it a little bit shorter. A little bit shorter. Hopefully we still have enough speed to get over the edge. So if we, like, chain lift it up to here... Hopefully that's still a 55 meter drop. Um, why don't we go ahead and... Oh, no, shit, 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 shit. Go ahead and... No, shit. Come on. Come on, just select that piece of track. There's only, like, one frame where I can do it. There we go. Let's go ahead and delete this all the way back down to its base. And then we can go back up and make a drop. No, why are you fucking with me? <laughs> okay, there we go. Now, I think we make it a sharp drop, because I don't think a lot of the fear is coming from a straight drop. Maybe start with a slightly less angle, and then just plummet. Just plummet. Straight plummeting. That's the name. Straight plummeting. Um, Alright, we gotta we gotta taper it off a little bit. Yeah, that might be a little sharp. That might be a tad bit sharp. Gotta start a little bit earlier. Uh, hopefully this is a 55 meter drop. Okay, and now now we come back into the straightaway and dock back with this piece. And that's, that's straight enough, even enough. Um, this is too sharp. This is too fast, too sharp, too furious. We gotta, we gotta just straight up delete this. I really liked it, too. Really liked it. So, what do we do? What do we do? This might, honestly, might have to be a shorter coaster. It's just, it's just sort of the nature of things, is that, um, you know, as much as I like this, for the drop we have now, we might not have the speed to get through it. And also, if we have all these sharp turns that are going too fast, because you want to have the turns for the excitement, but you just can't have them for the nausea at this speed. So we might have to cut out a fair bit of this, maybe even the Crazy 8, as much as that pains me to say the Crazy 8 might have to go. Um... Alternatively, we could get rid of this section and then maybe just put it back into the Crazy 8 and hopefully they have enough speed. So, what if we just... We need a more gradual turn. Gradual turns. Can we even, like, just... This sounds a little scary to me. Even, even for me, it sounds scary. Uh, but what if we just, like, put it back into a reverse turn right away? And dropped it back down. We need to figure out a way to connect it. Uh, well, we might as well, like... No, 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 that's okay. Okay, okay, okay. Let's, let's go ahead and get this shit out of the way. It's kind of in the way right now. Okay, there we go. Nope, okay, whatever. <sighs> Sometimes this is finicky. Alright, we're dropping this down. Uh, probably one more curve and then just snop the curve on that one and there we go and then we just dock it straight back up with that we pretty much eliminated this giant turn but this was honestly a large cause of the fear are these sharp turns right here that didn't really add a whole lot um, I'm still worried we might not have enough speed to get back but we honestly there's no point in not trying to see if this works any better Okay, so let's go ahead and start the test, see if it's any better. I don't, I kind of doubt it, I kind of doubt it, but I would love it, I would love it. Alright, get up there on speed three, come on, just work out for me, baby, that's all I ask. Alright, and then down. Oh shit, I don't know if that's 55 meters anymore, whoa. Okay, Oh, that turn's still a little scary, this one not as bad. Can we make it up to crazy eight? It looks like it. It looks like it. Oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay, stalling at the top. A little slow. A little slow for my taste, and I think the excitement was going to dry off there. 
that turn we might need to work on. But it's mostly at this point seeing if we can make it back to the start. And I don't know. I don't think we're making it up this last one we're coming up to. I don't think we're going to make it. We've run out of momentum at all. Oh, right over the hill. Holy shit, we actually made it. That is so close. So, so close. I don't know what people are going to think. It wasn't quite as scary, I'm hoping. It wasn't quite as exciting, either. It wasn't quite as exciting. Um, okay. Stop test. Yeah, yeah, fear's a little bit better. I'm sure there's still a bit of fear on this turn, right here. This little corner. Um, oh, pause it again. Uh, excitement went down. Excitement went down, but that's just kind of unavoidable in this situation, isn't it? Uh, do, is it a 55 meter drop? 56. <laughs> Woo! Cutting it close. Um, average speed went down as well, but that, that is understandable. Uh, anyway, I guess we go ahead and look at where did all of the fear come from still. A little still scary here. A little scary. I mean, this big drop is perfect, but it goes into a little bit too sharp of a turn and a double back. And then it comes back right at this turn. So we need to reduce that quite a bit. And is the nausea in the same place? Well, nausea is just here, but that's understandable here because it's such a big drop, putting a lot of Gs down on them. This one, I would like to start bleeding it off there because it is down to, like, nothing by the time you get to the Crazy 8, and it all comes back on that turn. So we have a couple of turns to work on, but otherwise I think this coaster is going to be looking good. But we will have to complete it next episode. Anyway, thank you for watching this episode of Planet Coaster, and I will see you next time.